Director for International Affairs for the Ministry of Infrastructure and Environment, Mr. Bob von Bolhaus. Thank you so much. Welcome again in, the, in Amsterdam. me again and again is that in fact as a procurers uh, they have power so if uh, a pre procurer uh, makes criteria for circularity then businesses will have to change the reason that um, this Congress is important I believe is well obviously governments have a huge uh, influence on, on, on buying they, 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 they spend a lot of money so uh, their actions are, are important and I believe that um, uh, governments can make a major difference uh, when it comes to implementing the circular economy. It's the first time I've seen an explicit link between public sector procurement and the ability to deliver a more circular economy. There's been a lot of talk about how do we create more circular economies and this is a really practical way of linking in what the public sector can do in terms of using its procurement to influence the delivery of a more circular economy. It's important to me because at the, the European Commission level there's a circular economy package and it's recognised that procurement is a key mechanism to deliver that. So this conference for me is about finding out more what is circular procurement and how can we deliver it and how can it achieve sustainable economy. Could you take your seats please now ladies and gentlemen? And we'll uh, hold the final plenary session and feedback. Get some snapshot feedback from the working group leaders, those that want to speak. I think we had a, we had a great group and a circular is about collaboration and cooperation. In a matter of time, circular becomes a spiral because resources, material are used over and over in different settings. And I thought that was a marvelous one, uh, not circular, but a spiral in time. I'm almost speechless. <laughs> we formally adjourn today's meeting. Thank you very much. And we look forward to seeing you on the boat or tomorrow morning at 9.30. Thank you very much.